Hello guys and welcome welcome back to the second video of this DevOps project series. So today I will be demonstrating about commit based job using Jenkins CI CD. Along with that I will be talking about how to configure webhook on github to trigger job on Jenkins. If you have not watched my previous project scenario video just go back and please do watch. So let's start. So first what we have to do. First, let's go to the Jenkins dashboard. So here my Jenkins dashboard, just click on new item. Just name a pipeline name, something like pipeline demo one. Okay, let's choose this pipeline option. Just click on okay. As here we are going to trigger the webhook, right? So this option should be um, this GitHub hook trigger for Git SCM. Polling this should be ticked okay after that what you have to do you just have to go here here in the definition section you have to choose pipeline script from scm because we are here going to use jenkins file so in the scm you have to choose like we are using git here just click on that and it will ask you for the repository you are just go to your project repository just copy the this url and go back to the dashboard and you have to paste this as i am using currently this public repository so i don't need any credential you can see like this i am using a public repository which and the branch is main here correct if you are using any private repository then you have to provide the credential by click on add and you have to provide here the github username github password along with id anything any random id so that it will be you will come to know okay once you will click on add on that you will get uh, the credential here and it will authenticate your credential with your repository url once this is done this is the branch specifier where you have to specify the branch for us our code is lying in the main branch you can see here just go back to this jenkins pipeline and you have to change this just click on main here we are we have to use this script a path as jenkins file here we i'm using the default name of the jenkins file if you are you are renaming renaming this jenkins file to anything else you just have to name the same okay once you have done just click on apply save and let's build the code okay so git checkout is successfully done so what I want here, once the GitHub, once we will push the code from GitHub or we will do any changes, we will commit any changes to the GitHub, this uh, uh, Jenkins should be, then Jenkins job should be uh, automatically triggered. We don't need to just click on build now. We don't want that, right? So let's go to the GitHub webhook. First thing what you have to do, just click on settings and here you can see you have webhooks in the left side just click on that and here you have add webhook option just click on that it will ask you for the password let me enter my password So once you will come here, you can see it is asking for payload URL. So from here, you have to trigger the Jenkins job. So in the GitHub, you have to provide the URL of Jenkins. Just go to your Jenkins. Just copy this URL. I have copied and I have pasted here. Along with that, what you have to type some extra lines like GitHub hyphen web hook. And along with that, you have to provide a slash. Don't forget to provide this. Once you have done that, it will ask you for the content type. So I am giving this application session and here, here you have to put the secret from your Jenkins server just. So for that, I'm going back to my Jenkins server. Okay, so I'm here. Just click on your username. Once you will click on that, you will have option like this configured. Just click on that. Okay, so here you can see you have this token and this token you have to paste to the webhook option. Just click on add new. You have to generate okay and from here you have to copy this and you have to provide the same to the jenkins so once you have pasted the token just click on add webhook 
so right now you can see it is sending some api request it is it has organized a ping event you can see here so let's re okay so you can see now it the webhook has been established successfully so let's do one thing let's go to our github code okay and we have to do some change okay so that the build should trigger automatically so let me go to that readme file and let me do some changes this is a not a, this is my okay this is my sample web, web application i'm clicking on commit changes okay let's go back to the jenkins server let's click on the dashboard let's go fast to our project pipeline demo see you it is still executing it's it is already executing so once you came here you can see it's just now it executed two second ago okay so like this the commit based job trigger has been done thanks for watching see you in the third part of this devops series thank you